According to the zonal coordinator zone C, the exportation of unprocessed timber contravenes Schedule 6 of the extant common external tariff, so that cutting down logs comes with negative impact, such as desert encroachment, adding that when if tree felling is not checked, the nation's economy suffers. This is uh, log of wood timbers in the rust stage. And government will be advocating to avoid felling of timbers, felling of our woods, our logs in around the country. You should know the effect of this one on the nation. One of them is uh, deforestation. When you deforest your environment, it leads to uh, what is called desert encroachment. It decried the economic loss brought upon Nigerians with the frustration of unprocessed logs, adding that the employment creation which results from the local processing of the logs is vital for Nigerian growth. If you start counting the uh, value chain of this uh, of felling of trees in the country, it's endless, starting from planters, starting from people that, the, 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 the furniture makers, that are youth that are looking for jobs. What is our problem? Why people will not desist from doing things that are against the policy of government? We need to be patriotic. The level where there is level of patriotism. If we are not patriotic, we will still continue to find ourselves at the same level. Also speaking, the FOU Zone C controller said that locks were about to be smuggled out of the country without clearance for the Nigerian Export Promotion Council. You see, anything that is exported illegitimately, it doesn't go through normal process, due process. You have to go to National uh, Export Pro uh, Promotion Council and acquire a form we call NXP, Nigerian Export Proceed Form, where the government will have statistics of things that are being exported so that the proceed will be repatriated in the country. But if these things go and checked in, you know what it means. The money will be used for, you know, to import some smuggle items that will be detrimental to the economy of the country. And it's not good for us. He therefore urged Nigerians to assist the government against smuggling activities in Nigeria. Egesame Itinye, AIT News, Port Harcourt.